All right, welcome back. We are on a quest. It's... Wow, okay, that's... Oh, man. On a quest to find a volcano, I guess? I've got some coordinates I'm looking for. I'm um, looking for 1620 and negative 2110. So that's going to be a bit of walking. Negative. Okay, so I'm going to have to go this direction. Whatever direction this is. Southeast. Heading southeast. There's lava everywhere. Oh, there really is lava everywhere. This could be quite the treacherous and adventuresome of a journey. We've got lava spilling all down into here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so there's supposed to be a volcano here. And then uh, there's supposed to be some kind of a river that I'm supposed to take a boat in. I, w I was given... Oh, hey, let's check this place out again. Somebody had said in one of the comments that there's this chest to the right of the furnace a couple nodes underground. I think it was to the right. I'm going to check that out. Um... To the right of the fern. I think somebody else already got it. Well, I don't know. No, they didn't. It's empty. Yeah. Somebody else already got it. Alright, well that's fine. Also, somebody dropped an air compressor in there. That's kind of weird. Whatever. The quest... The adventure, the discovery, it continues. Going southeast, south by southeast, I don't know. We are slowly hitting into some negative numbers here. There could be some uh, some stops along the way, you know. Oh, okay. I mean, sure, I guess foxes can swim, right? Bruh. Bruh, don't even. I ain't got time for this. Are you are you really gonna try that? I mean there's sharks in here too, so I should really get myself a boat. If I'm gonna try to do some long term discovery this way. I have wood. Okay, good. I want to say a boat's this. Um, I guess we'll just replace some sticks with it. I don't know. Um, there we go. All right, so well, let's this boat is terrible. There we go. And there's a shark. Hope he can't attack me in a boat. Well, it's been a lot of walking, but I think this is what I was supposed to get to. Um, oh boy. I don't have time to die right now, bro. Sorry. This would seem to be the, the coordinates I was given. I was told 1600 and negative 2100. Supposed to be a volcano around here someplace. I can only wonder if maybe I am scaling the volcano as I speak. Which, I mean, this does kind of seem to be the case. But I'm not seeing any lava spilling. So I'm not 100% sure. Uh, either way, it's a tall a monolithic structure that'll give me a great view of the surrounding landscape if I can ever get to the top of it. So either way, it's quite worth the effort of scaling to the peak, which 
the effort is not really that great. Okay, we do have light. I bet there is. Oh, yeah. Very nice. So I don't know what this is from. I mean, obviously, there's some mod that creates that. I'm assuming some mod created this. I don't think this is made by people. Um, take a quick look at the mods here. Anything here seems to be a volcano. Uh, well, if it is, it's not called volcano. Um, maybe from subterrain? Or maybe it's, oh, there's mine gas on here? Oh boy. Uh, oh, well, there's map gen helper. Um, climate API? Huh. DF caverns? It could be something from DF. That's, uh, you know, actually, I'm not sure what that is. They're all made by the same guy, though, I think. Well, this was quite the quite the fun and long to accomplish journey. Along the way, I did pick up some pineapples, which can be planted somehow, but I don't know how. I can get pineapple rings, or do I have to? Yeah, I don't know. Somehow you can plant pineapples. I don't know how though. That's something I shall have to look into or not. I don't think I really need to grow pineapples. I did also find some rhubarb and I have some cotton seed, which I think I had cotton seed previously and I planted it about by that little tomato farm and uh, it never grew. So. Yeah, I'm not really sure about getting anything out of that, but I figured if I found it, I may as well nab it. You never know. It might be worthwhile for something. Um, all right, so this was, yeah, no, there's a, I don't know if that's an orc or if that's a troll, because they're both kind of looking the same. One's just a different color. All right, so that is the volcano. And there's an abandoned base at 1420 and negative 1550. 1420 and negative 1515. Yeah, oh boy, oh boy. They're on both sides of me. They're closing in. Things could get bloody. Just kidding, I'm gonna outrun them. I'm not giving those guys a chance. Plus, I don't think they like the snow. Ah, they gave up already. Oh, well, I guess we can forget the whole comment about them not liking the snow. Cause obviously that dude had no problem spawning in in a snowy air. Oh, wow, okay. And now things get interesting. Or at least wise they would if they could damage me. I am fairly certain that while I'm standing in snow, I am invincible to these guys. About 99% sure of that. It's something weird with... Okay, uh, never mind. Maybe that's been fixed. I know in the past, if you stood in snow, you couldn't take damage. That's all I dropped. Useless. Absolutely useless. In the past, if you were in snow, you couldn't take damage because I don't know why, but you couldn't. It just it didn't work. Obviously, that's not the case anymore. I have already gone too far. I need to go this way. To 15. Um, oh, never mind. I thought there was a huge chasm here, and I was like, yeah, I can't get across that. 
but it's not the case. Right, so uh, theoretically, I'm going to be coming back towards some place I already was. Hey, look, we got some, some peas. I think, the, no, cucumbers, cucumbers. I think that's what this is. And I guess I had, no, oh, potatoes. Okay, um, tomatoes, you're going to have to say bye-bye. You know, it's always good to, to switch things up a little bit. Carrot. Um, well, you know, if I, you know, let me eat this cooked mutton. Kind of hungry anyways. Funny, I could have sworn there was only two of them there, but whatever. Okay, uh, I don't know what this is. Corn. Oh, well, f yeah, I'll take that. Uh, you know what, Cole, you're gonna have to go bye-bye. Man, what's this? Oh, it's just Tomato. I just saw a wasp. You can go bye bye too. Okay. Well, we're we're stocking the larder now. There's onions too. Right over here. I don't think I really have any interest in onions. Oh, look at all these carrots. Oh, and there's some more rhubarb. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna grab it all, man. And uh, more potato. Or wait. Then what's this? Is this the onion? Yeah, that's the, I'm gonna leave the onion alone. I don't have the inventory space for it and I don't know of anything I wanna throw out. Some beets, or beet roots as I guess it's called in some parts of the world. I've always just called them beets, but uh, I would grab these but I, I can't because I don't have inventory space, so I'll just pick them all and let them rot. That way the next guy who comes along can't get any. You know, it is an anarchy server after all. The goal of playing here is to make everybody else's life as miserable as possible. I don't know if that's actually true, but it may as well be. Okay. Looks like we're going in the water. Do I have a boat? Of course I don't have a boat. Um... You know what, I should have taken those last bits of coal I did have, and I should have turned them into torches. Oh well, no matter. I don't really know where I'm going to put the boat. I'll just throw the gravel away. Except I might need that. You know what, I've got two pickaxes for some reason. I don't really need two pickaxes. Oh, and there's a shark. This is... This is beautiful. Oh, and a crocodile. All right, all right, all right, all right. And they're ignoring me. Perfect. You never know. Oh, I see some torches. And what would appear to maybe be a, an entry. Okay, well. I mean... Wow, that was difficult, guys. That was difficult. I don't know if this is actually where I was supposed to get to. Oh, wait, there's a... <laughs> okay. Yeah, I just completely kind of, you know, looked the wrong way. Moose's little home. Yo, man. You got a bed, man? Nice. You got chests, man? Oh, and you even got stuff in them. All right, all right. Oh, I hope it doesn't matter that I shared the coordinates. That may have been a bad idea. You know, everybody's going to know where this is at. Oops. There is, there is stuffs. I don't know what these dragon eggs or gems are for, so I'm just gonna... Ooh. Mint leaves. Mint? I didn't know there was mint. Cave wheat. Cabbage? We's got cabbage? You know what? I got a lot of tomatoes, man. I'm gonna give you some tomatoes. 
I don't even know if anybody's actively using this. All right, what do we have here? Okay, well, somehow this stuff, well, some of it grows at least. Um, Y'all currently growing any of these? Because, uh, you know, I'm going to, do I just plant pineapple like that? I don't know. We're going to go ahead and plant the cotton there. I guess I really should have planted it by the other cotton. Oh, well, not worried about it. Um, I don't know how you get in there because lots of onions. Man, is there a lot of onions, bro. What are you doing with all these onions? Okay. How does one get into this? You can't. Okay. Well, no worries. It would appear as if they're not growing any of these items. But now they are. We'll just throw some carrots in here. I mean, it's kind of kind of unorganized now, but Oh well, beggars can't be choosers. Are you giving them free food? Oh yeah, how did they plant apples? See, that doesn't look like that's planted. That's not, it's not planted at all. Okay, so we're not cutting the pineapple with the sword. I can make pineapple rings that I can eat. Oops. Oh, that's how you get the pineapple tops. Okay, okay. Um, okay. Oh, never mind, that worked. Sweet. Throw these pineapple tops in here. Grow some more pineapples. And we shall... Oh, I guess I could have planted stuff on the ground down here. Oh, well. Oh, see, they had rhubarb and corn out here. Oops, my bad. What's this? Footprints cotton? Oh, that's the weirdest thing. Is that like trampled cotton? Okay, there is a hive. Okay. Um. Okay. Uh. Mm, uh. Bad move, probably. Please drown. Please tell me you're gonna drown. They're not. They're not drowning. Wait. Yes, they are. Ha, suckers! Nice. I guess that's pro tip if you're near a body of water and you have some some wasps following you. Just get yourself in the water and they'll they'll perish. I don't know what his problem was. He was just kind of there. Okay, I want to break this thing. Okay. Oh, what's this you say? You say you're allergic to water? Oh, well, what, what do you know? I happen to have the perfect spot for you. Dummies. What idiots. Okay, well. So that has been properly destroyed now. Um, I don't know how to get rid of this. If I even can. Oh, I was the only player. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, let's check out this little wall thing here with some torches on it. Um, let's turn all that stuff off because I don't need that on anymore. What is this all about? Oh. Okay. Oh, it's a compass GPS bookmark oh wait I didn't know that was on here I mean I probably did because I probably read it but I didn't remember it all right well so that's those discovered let's go check out this cave real quick 
before we wrap things up here. I probably should have, well, you know what? I got the pineapple rings. I'm assuming I have, yeah, I've got a bunch of tomatoes on me yet. So I'm probably good, probably good. All right, well, gents, you have yourselves. Oh, that was close. I've got 21 combo. Um, I can't, oh, well, that's all right, because I can reach this. I'll just grab that, and I'll grab that. And sure, we'll uh, just cut our way down in. There's a bunch of copper. Oh, some iron is up here. Not really too interested in the copper. I don't plan on spending enough time here where I would need copper for anything. However, I am interested in the iron slash steel because of the armor opportunities it opens up. If I can find enough of it. Ooh, there's some more. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Ooh, what did I just see there? Oh, that was just the dirt. I think I see some right over by that. Let me, uh... Ooh, there's some over there. Yeah, yeah. Now we're talking. I forget how many you need for a full set of armor. It's a pretty decent amount, though. I can't reach. Nope. Well, I can reach it now. And I may as well grab this silver. Because silver seems to actually be... <gasps> it's the mother load! I've struck it rich! I mean, sure, it's only iron, but... This is far more valuable to me than gold. I mean, diamond would be better, sure. But... You can't just go straight to diamond. Honestly, I don't even know if this pickaxe would break diamond. Might not. And if it didn't, then what good would that do me? I'd have veins of diamond, but no way to harvest it. Okay, I got 22. It's probably about time we start the smelting operations. Grab that. Um, I probably don't have a furnace on me. It's all right, though. Who needs a stinking furnace on them when you got all this cobble? I'll just throw right there. We'll throw these right here. I've got 83 coal. Throw it all in there. And then picks up some more coal right away. Because I gonna need it. And what do we have here? We have some more... Some more iron... Oh, we got some coal. Okay, good, good, good. She'll have to replenish my supplies. Very nice, very nice. All right, all right. Let's chuck that up in there. Um, that seems to be it from right here. I'm assuming this is more silver. So I'll grab that. Um, I kind of want to check that out, but should probably suit up in some armor before I do anything too crazy. Or I could go down that way. Hmm. So many options. Silver lumps. All right, well, let's, let's plop those suckers in there. You know, I'm gonna grab this coal, uh, this copper too. Uh, I can use it for copper rope boxes, but I would have to have rope to do that, and I don't have any rope, and I don't have any vines, and I don't have any cotton, so I can't make rope. So uh, yeah, I pretty much can't do that. So that's kind of kind of useless to me right at the moment. All right, let's do. We got some pants. We got some boots. We got us a chest plate. 
and I lost my helmet at some point. That is a tragedy. And I forget how to make a shield. There we go. That's all of my... All of my metal used up. Oh! Nice try, bucko. Glad I had my armor on. Uh, we'll throw the gold in. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna... You're gonna gang up on me, huh? All right, well... Woof! Woof! Just let me grab my stuff there, bro. Oh yeah, oh yeah. He's having a grand time. I'm hoping he killed the spider. You know. Nope. Come on, bro. Really? How did you not kill the spider with all of that? All of these explosives. And you didn't even kill the spider? <laughs> like, come on, dude. How is that possible? A spider should have definitely been dead. All right. Well, um... I don't need that. I'll just drop it. Oh, I have another steel or another. I don't know why I have all these silver pickaxes. My armor didn't take any damage. Something's weird with that. Like, you would expect that to have been damaged. Okay, well. Adventure awaits. Fortune favors the brave. Uh, let me grab my furnace. Just cause. I've grown attached to it, you know. It shared that traumatic experience of being attacked by a dungeon master, so we now have like a deep bond. You know, and like it means something to me. It's not just any old furnace anymore. It's a furnace that shared a near-death experience with me. Wait, there's a sign. What does the sign say? Tell that it's buried. Don't even try. Okay. I don't know why you would tell anybody that, but... Okay, I'll try. Does this mean there's a lava trap? Hmm. I'm guessing not. There is some iron though, so it's it's become worth my time. Ooh, and there's more iron. Nice, nice. All right, all right. Okay, I'm guessing it is encapsulated within this obsidian. Oh, or this obsidian. Now, what would my... What would my options be here? Well, I could try blowing it up with TNT. But that would require me having TNT, of which I do not. I also don't have gravel with which to craft it. Okay, well, I'm, I'm pretty sure they have this pretty completely covered up. Or it's a trap and it's actually some lava inside of there. Which I would totally do. Fool people into thinking that there's a travel net. When in reality, there's lava. And then they bust it open and the lava spills out. And, well, you know, the rest, as they say, is history. Yeah, I can't get in that. Not with my wimpy silver pickaxe. I don't know if a steel pickaxe can break obsidian. I'm guessing not. 
I would probably need diamond, mithril, um, or maybe meese. I've only got some meese shards though, so I can't really do anything with those. Oh wait, is it, was all this cobble over here? Maybe this was it. There's a footprint in that dirt. So maybe that was it. All right. Let's see if we have the fortitude and the wherewithal to make our egress. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, and we have something over there. It's all right, we need to go this way. Maybe I should, uh, you know, make the stairway a bit more accessible. You know, why take risks if you don't have to, right? Uh, which which means don't do this. But I'm going to do it anyways. And you know what? Why do that when you can do that? And do that. Um, this does not seem to be the means of egress that I thought it was. Oh, wait. No, maybe this is. Yes, this is. This is the means of egress. Okay. Um, well, I think so anyways. Because I definitely remember this. I just, how did, how did I get to this? How did I end up in this position? Did I put the dirt there? Maybe I did. I don't see like a stairway leading into this. What's over here? Um, oh wait, here we go. Oh, I have found it. Now I'll have to do some janky stuff to get up and back to the base, but I'll just do that off camera because nobody really wants to watch me dig tunnels around the subsidian here. That would just, you know, this would be really boring, wouldn't it? You don't want to see me do this. So we'll just, we'll just wrap it up here. And, uh, Maybe we'll have another episode. Maybe we won't. I don't really know. I'm not even sure how all of this stuff will be edited together. I have a bunch of stuff recorded and has all yet to be turned into edited footage. So, so we'll see how that goes. And maybe it will be four or five videos. Maybe it'll be six videos. Don't know. But thanks for watching. Tune in for other videos at other times, <laughs> and I'll see you then.